The track we're racing at this weekend is called the Laguna Seca Raceway, our WeatherTech Raceway, and it's an extremely challenging track. It's probably one of the most challenging in the United States. This competition is an individual time trial, so each team is just going to go out and run the fastest lap that they can. This is a road course where there's left and right turns. But in addition to that, there's the elevation change. It's a very challenging problem, both perceiving where the car is autonomously and then deciding how to steer, throttle, and brake the vehicle with such a dynamic change in what the car needs to do as it moves through the turns and up and down the hills, and sometimes at the same time. In the past two years, we've made so much progress to be able to be here and just to be where we're at in our standing and to go into competition tomorrow, feeling pretty competitive and feel like we can place well is, I'm so proud to be part of this team. It's very important to figure out how you're going to slow down, when you're going to slow down, how much, so that you can go around the turns without sliding out or losing traction, um, but then also maintain that fastest lap time as possible so you can win the race. We spent a lot of time developing at the Las Vegas road course, uh, perfecting our car, perfecting some of our uh, technical attributes on the vehicle, um, making sure that our programs are up to date. Now that's put us in an excellent position to compete uh, directly against some of the top teams in this challenge. I am never more proud to be at Purdue. Um... Second place, the Purdue uh, Autonomous Racing Team. Go Boilers!